Welcome. Today I'm going to show you how to easily accept Bitcoin payments onto your OpenCart website, which is Blockonomics' newest uh, Bitcoin uh, e-commerce integration. So to start off with, as you can see, I'm on the Blockonomics website. Um, for this, you're going to need to create an account uh, because I've shown it in a variety of other videos. Um, I will hold off on doing that. Uh, but if you need some help, you can check out other videos that I'll provide in the link below or um, take a look at uh, the Medium article that I'll provide a link below or uh, contact one of our um, helpful team on our Telegram channel, which I will also leave a link below. Now, uh, as you can see, I'm on the Blockonomics homepage. Uh, I'm going to hit on the Merchants tab. That will take me to uh, all our merchant uh, products. Um, at this point, this is when you would have needed to log in, but uh, I'm already logged in. Then you can see uh, I'm going to click on the Open Cart plugin, and that will take me to our GitHub page. Uh, this is the GitHub page where you'll find a file. You can see down here, here's a simple install process. Um, if you already know what you're doing, but you're then going to, I'm going to click on releases, and then it'll take me to this page, and then I'm going to want to download the Blockonomics open cart zipped file. So I'm going to open that and save it. Then I'm going to pop over to my uh, open cart shop and uh, move through the next steps of the uh, installation process. Uh, I'm going to hit on the extensions tab and then down to installer and then I'm going to upload the file I'm going to go to my downloads choose the zip file do not unzip it and uh, upload it onto the onto the open cart website after that's installed I'm then going to head over to the extensions tab and then uh, find, you're going to click here and go to payments. And that will show up all the different uh, payment plugins that you can get. And you can see here that Blockonomics is listed. So I'm now going to hit on the install button. And now we've only got a few more steps uh, until you're ready to accept Bitcoin payments. Uh, the next step is to make sure that you've got your API key set up and uh, have the callback URL so the Blockonomics can handle the uh, transactions. So I'm going to hit on the blue edit button, and it'll take me to uh, this page. First off, I'm going to make sure that it's enabled, uh, that, so that uh, just as you would with any of your other uh, payment uh, options. Then uh, you can see here that the Blockonomics API key is blank. So you can see that I'm back on the uh, Blockonomics uh, website, and I've hit on the Merchants tab, uh, and I am on this page. I'm going to hit on Get Started for Free. And then uh, we need to set up the XPub key. Uh, that We've got a little uh, uh, thing down here that shows uh, how to find your XPub key for uh, the majority of popular wallets. Uh, it's also in a couple of other videos. Um, but if you need more help, uh, we can try to help you out. So once you've got your XPub key, you're going to place it, paste it in there, then hit go, and then uh, it is uh, you, uh, you're ready to get set up to get that API key and that callback URL. So then uh, you can input the uh, callback URL here in order to get that callback URL. Head back over to the uh, Open Card Blockonomics. Uh, um, edit area. You'll see here that it's called the notification URL, but actually that is the callback URL. You'll take this URL, copy it, head back over to Blockonomics and paste it into here and then hit on save changes. Make sure that that XPub key is the one that you input in, uh, inputted earlier. Now in order to put in to get the API key, you're going to hit on Wallet Watcher. It'll take you to the uh, to our Wallet Watcher service. Uh, it should have the um, addresses ready uh, once you've inputted the XPub key earlier in the Merchant tab. You'll hit on Settings. Then you can see here that the API key is right here. 
You will then take the API key, copy it, head back over, and paste it in here. Then uh, make sure that the, uh, that the um, plugin is enabled, and you can hit save. And so that's it. You've now uh, set up the Blockonomics uh, Bitcoin payment plugin on your OpenCart website. So to see how it looks, uh, as you can see, I'm on the um, on the uh, checkout page of a uh, open cart website. Uh, I've got uh, something in my cart. I've filled out all the information, and then in the payment method, you'll see that there's an option for Bitcoin. So I'm going to hit on the Bitcoin, read the terms and conditions, confirm the order, and then you can see here. This is uh, the screen that the customer will be given. They will be able to send the Bitcoin to this wallet. will be shown the amount of Bitcoin and the amount in USD. And uh, they'll send it directly to your wallet. And so that's it. You've now successfully uh, set up the Blockonomics plugin, our newest uh, plugin. And uh, you'll be able to accept Bitcoin onto your open cart website. Always remember, we've got uh, our Blockonomics team standing by if you've got some support problems or if you want to talk more about suggestions and uh, other products. Until next time.